more time with the 1957 Cadillac Coupe de Fleur, the Cadillac flower car made by Superior. So I had to take another look. See, the hood is strapped down. And the doors are wired shut. And there's tires in the back that are ready to be mounted. I'm gonna mount them on the rims, not me, but they will be mounted and this car will roll again. It will move again. And all of this is because this rare flower car is actually sold. And it's going to be moved out of here. So, somebody is extremely ambitious to take on a project like this. And I can't give away all the secrets, but they have very big plans for this. And if he's able to make it happen, it's going to be quite the cool, unique vehicle back on the road again. And it won't be exactly stock. It will have more or less the stock appearing body on the outside with a lot of help from donor vehicles. But uh, it'll be special and unique in other ways. So, I just wanted to show this thing is getting secured. Don't want the hood to fly open going down the road. As you see, it obviously doesn't, doesn't shut well. It's got a little ding in the hood there. I've been told there are people coming to pick it up. So before it goes, this is the one last look. And I'm hoping it won't be the last look for good. Because I want to see this thing get finished. I don't know how long it's going to take, but it's going to be extremely ambitious. And obviously quite time consuming, but it will happen, and I'm pretty excited to see the results. So, new owner, I wish you all the best. Because this is pretty cool, and it's going to be an awesome project. You see the bed is cleared out. And the trim pieces that go with the car, they're sitting in the back here. So that's it, just a quick, a quick look at this flower car before it heads off down the road.
So they are going to put the flower car on that trailer. Along with that van. I don't know that there's room enough for both. But I wish them luck. Ese ring está casi a la mitad enterrado. Coba. Bueno. Well, there is where the 1957 Cadillac flower car had sat for a number of years. Oh! And there it still sits. So they did manage to drag it maybe 10 feet or so. But they just couldn't get it any further. So, here it sits. As I said from the beginning, they need a rollback wrecker to winch this out. But the new owner said he could he could get it pulled out, and they did give it a valiant effort, but uh, it's just not quite there. So, the next step, I believe, is to get the, the roll back back here and have it hauled out. Too bad, they worked for a couple of hours. That's where it sits. So, till the next step, it'll be here. <laughs>